Oh, hello, everybody. How the devil are we all doing today? We're doing well. Right, so I haven't played Astro in a while. We, um, we started a game the other day, so we're going to uh, jump back into it, and hopefully it's going to be fine. Hey, Stu, how are you doing? Uh, no. Or hopefully, hopefully, um, Xbox and Twitch are going to be are going to play together nicely and not fuck up the sound. I love this game completely before it actually came out, but I wasn't allowed to use my save. Yeah, when it fully comes out, um, it basically turns around and says, Oh, yes, your save may be corrupted. All right, okay. So, yeah, the last thing that I did on this the other day when I actually started playing was we got the train up and running fully. Um, we've got a, a little bit of a base, nothing sort of amazing up and running. But what we do need to do is we need to go find some warp points. Also, what are our missions? So, uh, print off an auto arm, store a resource with an auto arm. Unlock an exo research aid. Unlock and print. Okay. Print a small shuttle. Oh, power cells, glow sticks, and dynamite. Can we do those? Right. Um. Oh, the watch again. Power cells. With glow sticks. Dynamite. Right, so the, the reason that I wanted to get those done straight away is because we can now claim this one. <laughs> Which gives us another one of those. So if you've never seen one of these um, RGTs before, uh, actually unlimited energy. So we'll put that on the base. You're on the right track. Dum dum. You're <laughs> Uh Oh, I I think I got another mission as well, didn't I? Uh, unlocked potential. Unlock 100 schematics in the catalog. Okay, so we could probably start looking at doing that because we've got all this astronium burning down. Oh, thank God. But let's have a look what we've got in the catalog. We've got 7,000 bytes. Let's unlock a shuttle. So we're going to need solid fuel thrusters. We can't do the hydrazine thrusters yet because we don't have steel. Get steel, we need iron. Where in the holy hell are the shuttles then? The shuttles can't be medium storage. They've got to be large. Or medium printer. Are they across in one of these? Right, we can't do the VTOL. Train, foghorn, rail engine, rail car. Also extract large shredder we can't do. Large rope, but landing power, here we go. So we can we can only make a small shuttle at the moment can't make a, a medium shuttle because we can't do aluminium alloy and we definitely can't do a large shuttle because we can't do titanium alloy we need wolframite for that 
So, uh, um, I'm not going to build a landing pad because we should land here. However, I do get the feeling we're going to need yeah, another table. Free resin. How are you at the moment, Stu? That astronium that actually uh, researches for quite a lot, but it um, we, we've got enough of it. Uh, I want a tractor, I want a trailer, so one compound, one out. zinc, zinc, zinc. Ali. Compound, compound. Yeah, because I've already got one. We're going to try and make a couple, uh, a tractor, a couple of trailers for it. Um, I was going to say we haven't got the last printer. Yeah, we're going to try and make a tractor, a couple of trailers, and then put some power on the trailers and go find the, um... Oh no, wait, shit, we did make the giant printer. The giant printer's over here. Well, we've got a spare table now. Let's, um, let's drop you down there. Let's connect you... You're going to go on there. Right, so, what I can do... Over here we have the RTG, which is an infinite power supply. Oh wait, we've got a second one. The RTGs only take up one slot. I thought they took up two. Okay. So, take a second. Will that show me how much they create? So, produces 1.5 units. How much do you... You produce 5 units. So, it would be more beneficial for me, technically, to put a storage on here. Well, you only produce one. Okay. Hmm. What do you produce? You produce four. Uh, I've got a medium generator. What does that produce? You produce nine. You're coming with me. Because you're a lot more reliable. So, if I take you off there. You on there. Right, because that will produce one. That will produce two. Uh, I'm going to take you off there. You off there. How much do the small generators create? Let's create two units. Okay, so small generators are actually better. So, fortunately, let's connect you guys. Uh, There's one. I've got another small generator. 
Two more to go on there. We've got a small solar. Yes, I do. How much do you make? You produce a unit. Alright, we'll take the small solar. We'll take the small wind. So the only thing I need to do is I need to make sure I've got adequate material to power the generators. So I need organic and carbon. Those are both resin. Organic in there. Come with me. Put those up there. Let's go and make some carbon. Come on. Grab a couple of research samples. Why not? Organic. Another one, and another one. Oh no! <laughs> got too much organic! Go and put this on. Go and put this over here somewhere. Right. So, I'm going to burn you up. You. You. Don't need the rail track so I can drop that into things. Oh, give me just one second, guys. I've just got a text message. I've got to answer. See, really simple. There we go, that's done. Right, so, ooh, my Twitch has just had a massive, massive. So that's going to give us four carbon, and we've got one carbon on there. You go on that. Three, four. I'm probably not going to need all of the um, gun mods that I've got on. In fact, no. I'm going to leave the. I'm going to leave the gun mods on. I'm going to leave the gun mods. On. Right. So we got carbon. We've got organic. Plenty of things on there to give us power. Let's go and find some of the um, some of the war points and see if we can actually get them to uh, work. Canyon arrow. Canyon arrow. Oh, there's a giant resin field. Nice. Oh. Oh, we have got all three trailers, haven't we? I'm just out here driving my tractor. We're just trying to see... Oh, there's, oh, there's one hiding sort of in that aurora. You can see the, the column of light coming up. stuff over here. What have we got? We've got small wind, large solar, another light. We'll turn... No, it doesn't turn on. Is there power here at all? Oh, damn it. I thought I could take the oxy generator then. 
I say that'd be absolutely fantastic if I could steal that oxy generator. I don't need to make one for when I'm going travelling. There's a couple of nice items there. I should probably try to go around the around the mountain road. But the tractor is just so goddamn. Oh, no. Actually, the reason why I kept my uh, gun mods on. When in doubt, I'm just going to go through the main. We're going that away. Yo, well, how you doing? Can you narrow? Can you narrow? Come on, little tractor, you can do it. No, oh, come on, come on. Are we, are we, are we truly stuck? I think we're stuck. Oh, I've got another text message. Hang on, hang on. Right, there we go, there we go, there we go. You're looking for a PC, a gaming PC or a works PC? This. Oh, you fucker. Was the base of this a lot further down? It is, but there's also a gully just there. Okay. Yep. Right. Okie dokie. We are going to have to do this different. Oh, if we can actually... Oh, yep, that's fine. We'll just back the tractor up into here. Perfect. So. I'm too low. Shit. Boom! Perfect, look at that. That. Jump on me, tractor! Uh, I guess cooling on my Mac just died and I've start it started making sounds it's definitely not supposed to make. Um, could you not get, like, a cooling mat and see if that'll stop it overheating? It, it might not do anything for the sound, but... Right, okay, we need to clear this platform. This is why I love taking the RTGs anywhere, because they're really small, they'll fit on your backpack. And especially when I've got these uh, mods on my gun, it just means that I never have to worry about power. Right, well, the location of this one kind of sucks. There's, uh, yeah, there's just a cliff face down there. Okay. Uh, 
Uh, jump on the tractor, please. I want to come over this. Far enough. All right, our big generator turned on is enough to do this. What we're doing is we're just powering the um, powering this because this is actually a warp point. But it's not a very good one. It's... But oh well, it's not a problem. Dude, what? generators back off. Oh! Oh! That... That big generator wasn't turned on. Okay, so we just did that straight off the little generators, the, um, the RTGs and the tractor. Does anyone know which is a better, dis uh, better display port or HDMI? Um, I... It depends what you want. I think if you want just picture... Then display port. If you want picture and sound, HDMI. It could be wrong, but I'm fairly confident that's what it is. Out. Oh, we can get out through here. Nice. Oh, let's not. Fall down the massive freaking crevice. This chat is why we normally carry a dirt canister with us. Come on! Have we got all the tractor? Yeah, we got all the tractor. Um, well, I use headphones, so I do not need sound. Um, so yeah, if you're if you're gonna use headphones all the time, then probably display might be better. Um, on there is a, a flip side to it. Are you plugging it into an actual monitor, or are you looking at plugging it into a TV? So I mean, I've got my TV in the living room, and I used to have my um, my PC plugged into the actual television itself instead of into the um, into the PC monitor. Much bigger screen, I could um, play games further away. So for that one, I had HDMI. Come on, I'm looking for another line in the sky, because I don't think they're those ones. Unless they've made them, like, really, really freaking obvious. No, I'm looking um, which PC to buy. Usually they have one HDMI, HDMI and three display ports. Um, yeah, so the display ports will just be for multiple displays then. But if you've got uh, if you've got a HDMI connection, you can connect it to your TV should you want. Come on, my little tractor! Don't give up on me now. Oh, we've hit a shell. Of all. Th oh no! Come on! Come on, come on, we can do it. Ooh, is that a big um, solar panel? That might be one of the giant solar panels. If it is, it's a bit of a shit that it's all the way out here, but it's always nice to know where the giant solar panels are. Right, I'm going to leave the tractor here. A quick run over. Uh, 
no, you're not. You are you are a solar panel, but you're not one of the giant solar panels I can use. Is there a giant light going up there? Oh, no way. I think it just goes around the world. Okay, yeah, that's definitely not what I'm looking for. I am looking for a column of light coming from the floor up to the sky, but not quite that one. Uh, so we'll connect one HDMI and one display port at least. Yeah. So if you're only using one monitor, then you'll only use one display port. But then the HDMIs, I think it all... Yeah, the HDMIs as well. Oh no, I was going to say, it depends. I'm, I'm thinking the way around. I'm thinking HDMIs on a, on a television. On the television, you want multiple HDMIs because you can plug multiple things into it. If you're looking on the PC thing, aha, I see the column of light over there. Yeah, from a PC point of view, you only really need one HDMI because you're only going to plug it into one television. Canyoneru. Canyoneru. Need to dodge all the areas that I'm going to fall down. Hi, Zef. How you doing? Ah, right. This one's actually in quite a nice area. It just looks like a ramp. Like a nice gentle ramp, if possible. Might be a little... Yeah, that's definitely too gentle. I am going to need a steeper ramp than that. Hey, what? Let's, let's level this out and start again. So, I need to dig down. Great. There we go. That's pretty good. That's not a bad ramp. And we want to level out this to make it easier for our tractors. Yep. Beautiful. No problem whatsoever. I'm doing alright. How are you? I'm not too bad. Um, work is still soul destroying, but that's just because, quite frankly, I'm not doing a fat lot there. Um, I, I've had this sort of other job offer that they've told me I will get a, a proper a proper offer in the new year they absolutely want me but the, the head office has put a freeze on um, a freeze on hiring oh crap oh, we're going all the way around come on tractors oh Come on, you can do it! <laughs> Slowly but surely going to pull the entire tractor off. Yeah, they've put a hire on, uh, a freeze on hiring. So they've said the moment that comes off, which will be the start of next year, that I'll be get off I'll get offered the job. So unfortunately, at my current place, I've kind of checked out. Is that going to be close enough this time? Oh no, it's going to be miles away. Right, okay, we'll, we'll cheat, we'll do it this way. No, I don't want to drop it on my own head. There we go. Like that, that, that. And put that on. There we go, nice. So that's now draining from the track. Oh, I think the track is empty. And we're still draining that quite nicely, so.
Nice, there's the second one. So what that does now, that gives us an odd stone. So we've activated those two. There are obviously six of these around the planet. And then there's one core. But because we've unlocked two of them, it means we've now un we've opened the core. So if I go back to my base... Yeehaw! If I go back to my base, we can actually find the core is now open and we can uh, access the core. And what that'll do is allow us to walk all the way around the world. But it's not the world we're actually concerned about. When we go to other planets, um, we can do the same thing. And there is a mysterious satellite. You can warp to the mysterious satellite if you um, unlock the planets on there. And that means that instead of having to get shuttles to go back and forth between the planets, you can actually just warp between the planets. Which makes it so much quicker and so much easier to move materials. Search for an We're going to search for another column of light, and if we can't find another one soon, we'll head back to the base. Reconnect the big train. Region? Forest. I'll tell you what, I wouldn't have known it's a forest. I could not see it because of the trees. Did a duts. But column of light? Anywhere? I hate going over the plains because there's always massive crevices. Yep, yeah, there you go. In the crevices region. Whoa, there's one. Nope, gonna go this way. Oh, we go back on regular plane. Right, so... See, that column of light there is not the column of light we're looking for. No, no, no! Come on, tractor, pull! Good tractor, good tractor. If I see another column of light that I'm looking for, I will show you that in case anybody hasn't seen it. Uh, so, I know Alk is um, looking for PCs at the moment. What's everybody else doing at the moment, then? Not all getting drunk and watching Wolfie uh, drive around a planet going, I can't see the light! Getting a bit rocky here, chap. Getting a bit rocky. Bit of a dodge. Yep, duck, dive, and dodge. Alright, so we're going to come out to the middle of these planes. We're going to have a look around. Right. Aha! Right, you see that column of light over there? That column of light there, that's what we're looking for. So we've got one there. Okay. I can he see another one. We're going to go for that one. Canyonero. Canyonero. All of these wreckages as well that I'm just driving past, there's probably some good stuff on there that I could collect. Unfortunately, my backpack is full, so there's no point in me stopping because I can go, look at all this really good stuff that I'm just going to have to leave here. Hey, there he is. Oh. Tractors going very sideways. Have to. Come on. Come on. Yes. Oh, this one's on planes as well. Nice. Uh, also, I'm counting how I'm going to pay for this stuff. Have you thought about selling organs on the black market? I mean, I, I don't mean yours, I mean like other people's. Oh, that was a terrible ramp chat. Didn't freaking work, did it?
Let me try that again. That's much better. Oh, we've lost power. It's fine. We're back to using just the basic gun. That should be enough to get the uh, the old tractor up there. Oh, our oxygen's getting low. Uh, nothing much. I did some cooking today and some art. What what did you cook? What was for what was for tea then? I mean, so far I I will get an OnlyFans account. Well, you know. Can't really judge. Plenty of plenty of people have made a shed load of money off any fans. Come on. Come around this way. Nice. Ah, the wind's blowing, so we don't need to turn the generators on at the moment. The moment the wind stops, we have to turn that big generator on. No, it's stopping. There we go. You are not here to judge people. You are here to uh, bypass. Exactly. I'm not judging you. Well, I mean, there's a load. There's a loads and loads of people. There's, there's one woman in, in the UK, um, and she's openly turned around and said how much money she's made off OnlyFans. And there's a shitload of people basically going, "Oh my God, you know, you, you're doing OnlyFans. How can you possibly do OnlyFans and sell yourself like that?" And, you know, just, just throw your body on the internet. And her response is, well, I'm making about 300 grand a month. And it's like, that's a very fairly valid reason, I suppose. Um, let's have a look. Can we see another column of light? See, because you notice the column of light above them stops once you've actually claimed it. Let's go and have a looky look. See if we've got one more over here. If we can find one more, great. If we can't find one more, then it'll affect the base. In fact, where's my compass? Oh, the base is this way anyway, so we'll head this way. If we get another one, fantastic. If not, we are heading back towards the base. Ew! Ew! The tractor crashed. RTC. Right, so the base is going to be over to the left. Uh, chicken salad and roti? I don't even know what that is. Chicken salad. Yep, got me on that one. Uh... Column of light at all? Column of light. Oh. Compass. Base that way. Basically chicken curry and bread. Oh, okay. I know what that is. It's a fancy name for it. Sorry, I just had a delivery of an energy drink, so I had to take that. Oh no! Oh, oh, there's part of a ship. Um, shit. Uh, right, navigate through the tree. Go, little tractor, go! Um. Wiggly worms, we just can't catch him. Wiggly worms, I'm crashing into the tree. God oh, damn. This was making so much progress. Right. Have we got a column of light over? No. Which way is the base? Base is that away. Oh, I think I know where we are. Yeah, I think I know where we are. I don't think we're too far from the base. I could be wrong. Not seeing any columns of light. Or... Uh, 
something. Dodge the hole. Uh, I think. Gosh, I think. Uh, tonight I had uh, chicken goujons and roast potatoes tea. Because it was something, uh, something light and simple. Driving through the forest. Nope. Sitting on top of the fuel, on top of the uh, ammonium fuel. Base is that away. There we go, we can see the train system. Welcome to the jungle gym. Let's see again. Right. Uh, oh, that looks like it's that connected. It's now. That should be able to connect. Oh, okay. Ah, it will connect. That can connect to that. No. There we go. That provides power to everything else. This means that the train should have power. Yes, coming through there. I think, if I remember correctly, that this planet requires quartz. Right, now for anybody who's ever watched me play this before, I normally create a series of ramps that go all the way down to the core, um, and then I make the, the actual ramp bigger, so that way we can put a tractor down there, or we can, we can drive a tractor up and down. We haven't done that this time. Just loading up on Astronium again. This is all of my research bites. Okay. Each one of those is another 500 research bites, I think. Oh, no. Ain't gonna do much on the... No! No, don't put it on the soil thing. Yep, there we go. Get the whole thing. Yes. Uh, oh, I need quartz. I need quartz. Oh, that's uh, yeah. That's something I got to show you guys. Look, we have like a we have like a little creature. <laughs> it's playing hide and seek with us. Jump on the train. No. On on the train. Are you ready, chat? Ready. Go. This actually makes it so much easier getting up and down from the core. Because if you run up and down from the core, you've got to go up the ramps. If you drive a tractor down, it's slightly quicker, but you have to make sure you don't fall off the ramps. Once the train track is set up, you just literally go, right, drive the train. Because Drara has put the, uh, the big storage things on the back, which means that we can carry a shed load of stuff down to the core. Or carry a load of stuff back up. 
as you can see, it, I just basically tell the train to go, and away it goes. The only thing that's the only issue with the train is that it runs off, um, or the the more power it, it or the more power it has, the quicker it goes. But this is the planet's core, and our train track literally goes all the way down and parks on the side of the planet's core. So we wanted to go in here. Is this what I think it is? Is this this? No, absolutely. Bloody. Oh no, wait. No, wait, 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 wait. It might be. It might be. Whee! Uh. Aha! Yes, yes, it was. Right, sorry. No, I need. I need that. Need a second one. All right, so we've got two oddly shaped stones. So now we run. Whoa! Back up to the surface. Back up to the ceiling. One of these. And that. That dissolves. And we get an oddly shaped stone. So we click on that. There you go, so we've now got that one awake, that one awake, that one awake, the core is now awake, and then we've got the satellite up here, which we can't actually do yet, because we've not activated. Right, so what I'm going to do, so I'm going to take that, that, no, 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 no. Oh no, shit, I'm going to be taking the other train back on that there we might be able to see a little bit better you ready chat choo choo yeah gravity at the core is a little bit weird so the camera angle goes a bit funky but considering we're on the train um it doesn't really make much difference Chugga 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 woo woo So I think what we need is we need wolframite which is iron Um we can build a... Oh, sorry, we can look at building a shuttle. And we're going to have to see what we're going to need to take with us to basically create a successful base on another planet. But yes, this train system is absolutely amazing. And I imagine it will be going on every planet I go to. Right, um, shuttle, it's going to be in big one. Let's get the gyro ball. -hee -hee -hee. Okay. What do I need for the shuttle? Uh, two alley. Have I got the alley already processed in here? Got one. Right, okay, and copper. So while well, that's printing, what do we need to make a thruster? Not going to be in you, it's going to be in this one. One aluminium, one ammonium. Right, I don't have another alley, so we'll have to smelt one of those. And I think I've got one ammonium over here. Yeah. I know Stu said that he's played this before. Has anybody else ever played this before? 
Or is this like everybody's first time for seeing this game? Um, I actually want to make another thruster. Or I, I want to get another set of ammonium and steel. Uh, alley. I want to have enough stuff to make another thruster because the solid fuel thrusters break. Here's our big ship. Not very big, it's only actually a little ship, but... Uh, first time seeing it. It's a good game. It's... When it originally came out, so you can ask Dodge, we had an awful lot of weird and wonderful fun on it. Um, oh, shit. Oh, my ship's fallen over the chat. There we go. Just press go on. Yeah, we had all sorts of weird and wonderful fun on it because there were a shed load of glitches. Of which one of them, I, uh, on my screen, Dodge had got out of the car that we were in. Uh, on... Uh, yeah, on, on my screen. No, 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 sorry, sorry. Let me get this right. On his screen, I'd got out the car. On my screen, he'd got out the car. Um... But then the car just magically started driving away by itself. Uh, and on his screen, I was driving off with the car. And it's like, what the fuck? Right, I c what do I need to make an oxy generator? That's, that's going to be you. Isn't it? No. Okay. You? One alley, one ceramic. Right, the alley we can make, that's not a problem. Ceramic we can probably do with the soil centrifuge. Oh, we haven't got enough. Don't need the, don't need the quartz, so that... Need, I'm going to put that... Okay. Let's. I think we're going to use it. Let's burn up some. Uh, oh, burn up, smelt some alley. See, I could put an oxy generator in there, and that means that basically that entire slot is taken up by one thing. But the oxy generator only actually takes two little things to make it. So what I'm going to do... So I'm going to take... One alley which I can't find. Is that it? Yep. Oh, was that a ceramic? No, that's a carbon. That's a carbon. Those are both going to be glass. So, do we have another dirt canister? Uh, no, your oxygen tanks. Oil of carbon. Right, fine. What we're going to do... If I let's dig this out. Oh, bollocks. You know what would really work, chat, for me to fill up my dirt canister? Would be for me to pick up my frickin' dirt canister. My dirt canister is pretty much full. But yeah, this, this game had a, a lot of bugs to start with. They've worked out quite a few of them now. And they're um, they're adding lots and lots of different like, little features, which are rather funky. Um, it's not just focusing on this planet. It's focusing on a, a small solar system. 
Um, there's not exactly many sort of hostile creatures. In fact, I don't think there's any hostile creatures as such. There's hostile um, fauna. But that is what it is. Um, and you just... Basically, it's just like a fun little game of exploration. And it's kind of like No Man's Sky, but a little more... I don't know, PC? A little more family friendly. Uh, let's make some clay. For the soil centrifuge, what we're doing is we are putting soil into canisters. And it's going to spin it. Oh, apparently running out of power. Oh, we've got our power back. It's just suddenly um, better. But as you can see, it's got like little brown dots that are appearing underneath. And um, what's happening is that it's separating that from the oil. That's from the oil. From the soil, because that's what we've asked it to do. So in a minute, it'll go pink. There you go. We now have some clay. Right, so I wanted to make... Uh, the Oxy Generator, which was Alien Ceramic. So, we fire the clay, and that clay turns into ceramic. So again, with the Oxy Generator, I could basically take the clay and the, the alley to make the Oxy Generator, so it'll take up two slots. However, if I make the oxy generator, see how big it is, and then all of a sudden it goes, puts in a little crate for us. Instead of taking up two slots, it only takes up one. So I wanted to make a thruster as well. Uh, right, I don't have the ammonium. I'm going to have to go on the train to get that. Um, I will take one of those. Because it will be slow, but it will give, it, give us unlimited power. We're gonna, resin and compound can be found on any planet. What do we need to make a tractor? In fact, let's make a tractor. Tractor, two alley, and a trailer is an alley and a compact. So let's make a tractor and a trailer. So, two alley, alley, and a compound. But what we're doing now is we are preparing to leave this planet to go to another planet. Because we can fill up this storage here. Uh, I need to create a trailer. Yeah, we're going to fill up that storage, put that storage on our shuttle. Then we're going to fill up our backpack. And our backpack is going to be our second lot of storage. Right, so we've got tractor, trailer, oxy generator. We have power. It's slow, but we have power. Uh, when we get there, we are probably going to want to create a table... But what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to create a small printer, aren't we? So the small printer is printed on my backpack. And that takes one compound. So we're not going to put it on our, my backpack at the moment. Because if I do, I'm more likely to freaking press the button and make a small printer. Whereas that can sit in the crafting slot, which is a, like a bonus slot we get. So, my gun is full. 
My shoulders are full. We're not going to need the organic, so I'll drop that off. Um, if we decide to build a medium printer, what are we going to need? Two compound for the medium printer. So, one, two. What are we going to need for a bigger table? Earth. You right, puppy? Come here. Come here. What's the matter? It's okay. You've got a sneeze that won't come out. It's okay. It's okay. Calm down. Good lad. You okay? Good puppy. I do apologise. My puppy was having a small fit because he couldn't. Sn Are you done? <laughs> yes, Dad. I'm done. He was having a small fit because he couldn't sneeze. Right. So I need another resin. Which there should be resin out here somewhere. Like a little gyro ball. We look at us go. Yeah, that was the thing. Basically, he was snorting because he was trying to sneeze, but the sneeze wouldn't come out. Um, so he started panicking, uh, and he was having a bit of a uh, a bit of a moment. And it's like, calm down, just work it out. Or you'll sneeze in a minute. But because the sneeze wasn't coming, it just sounded like he was grunting and, and snorting and being a piggy. Right, so, if I put the three resin on there, but with like one compound on there, right, so, that is going to make me a small printer, a medium printer, a table, um, what do I need to make a landing pad? That's probably going to be the other thing. Shit, have I not unlocked the landing pad? Uh, one alley, two ceramic. Yep, we've unlocked the landing pad. So, one, two. So, one ceramic. I can go in there. Oh, joke! That was a pig! It wasn't a pig! It was my it was my little dog. It wasn't my big dog. It was my, my little doggy. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not allowed pigs in my house. I, uh, I am as much pig as there is allowed. There's two alley and a ceramic for that thing. Oh shit, but to do that, that's off a large printer. Yeah, fuck. What do I need for a large printer then? That's going to be off the medium. Three compound. I don't have three compound. I'm going to need to go get some more compound. But now the, li the little dog, when he when he's having a moment, he does sound incredibly silly. Um, we had it earlier on, I think it was this year, where he was out in the garden. Um, and he was trying to shake because he was wet and trying to sneeze at the same time. So what ended up happening was that he sort of sneezed, which made him sort of jump a little bit. As he jumped, he was then shaking to get the water off. So he sort of went up in the air a fraction 
and then he sneezed again, so it's like, Achoo! Achoo! And it's like, what the fuck was that noise, dog? Right, so. Medium printer. Small printer is one compound. Medium printer is two compounds, so that's three. Large printer is three compounds, so I need six. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six. So I should be two compound over. I don't know, in fact. I need that one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, okay, so I've got one space. So that's going to do medium print. Oh, sorry, small printer, medium printer, large printer. Landing pad, so I can put the shuttle on it. Um, I prob that, that last space. I probably need to take my dirt canister. Yeah, so I think this is going to be it. This um, let's put you. No, no, I want the entire thing. You, put you on there. Didn't want you closed. But... Right. So let's have a look at the Astropedia. We want all from my, I believe. So that gives us Wolframite in caves on De Solo. That gives us Wolframite in the mountains. Sun high, wind low. Sun very high, wind low. Okay. Titanite. Lithium. And you're right. Okay, so we... De Solo or Calador is basically where we're going. Now, I think we've got a mission on here for one of those, possibly both. Reclaim. Oh, no, we can claim out that again. And those are all complete. Right, so, where are we going to go then, chap? We've got a choice. We can go De Solo, which gives us Wolframite, which we need. Or we can go to Kalador, which gives us Wolframite. Go to Solo or Kalador. DLC. Kalador is more difficult because it's a medium. Solo is easier because it's an easy. Um, where do we want to go? Let's, let's let's put a vote in the chat. Poll. New poll. Next planet. Uh, De Solo. Calador. Uh, we'll put it on for two minutes. Right, there you go. Get your votes in, chat. Get your votes in. Where are we going next? Are we going Calador or De Solo? De Solo or Calador? So, description of Calador, average atmosphere, sun-blasted, dry. De Solo, no atmosphere, bare rocks, pockmarked. Where are we going? We're gonna rock down to Electric Avenue. And we're gonna fly to one of these planets. Coming up to the halfway mark on the uh, on the pole. Where are we going? Calador to Solo. If I had the money, Alk, I would get a house pig just so I could have a house pig on stream. If you see people that have dog cam, I'd have piggy cam, and I'd call him Chris. Chris P. Last name Bacon. Christopher Patrick Bacon. Chris P. Bacon. Uh, got about 30 seconds, I thought, left of the pole. Where are we going? 
we go into Solo, or we go in Galador. Where are we going? Oh, we've probably got about 10 seconds left. Uh, Calador. Okay. We're going to Calador. So, Wolf might be found in the mountains. So, we are going to... Uh, right, we'll launch to another planet. So, there is... There's one place we want to go before Kalador. Just gotta find it. So the all of the little planets you see, we can go to. Oh, there it is. We want to go to the unidentified satellite. <clears throat> there it is. Uh, it doesn't really make any difference where I go. I'm going to land that. So this is the weird and wonderful little satellite that we could see when we were back on um, back on that other planet. But we had no idea what the fuck it was. Oh, don't let me fall off that. However, which one is it? I think it's that one. We take this little stone, put it on there. There we go. That is our first stone on the space station. Or on the satellite. Right, so now we go on to Kalidor. Uh Fuel 50% launches to... So, launch into orbit. No, launch another planet. And we want... Calador. So your Atrox. Is that Calador? Is indeed. Travelling to Calador. Oh there goes my engine. My engine's just broke. I want to increase the speed of the spin on the planet. Kind of want to land next to one of those. I think there might have been one. Further round. That was like right on top of one. Right, now you're, you guys aren't exactly that close to one. You are probably the closest. Let's spin it a bit more. Let's have a look. No, no, that one might be pretty close. Okay. Let's land at that one and then make our way over to that one up there. Right, so now I have to use my Jedi powers. What the hell is that? Oh, that's the one form of plant, is it? Right, so... Yeah, we would go in... That away. Unfortunately, we can't run while carrying the ship, so we have to sort of. Who was that one? Wasn't it? Yeah, it was that direction we're definitely going.
have no idea whether these plants are friendly or not. Oh, they seem to be. All right, we're going that away. Sounds very windy up here. Oh, yeah, let's... Yeah, let's not drop the, uh, the ship off down that cliff face. See if we can get up here and then lift it up. Don't fall down. Woohoo! Oh shit, I've just fallen down there. Oh, that was close. Come on, you can do it. Right, thank you. Let me have some oxygen. That's our target over there. Okay, so we're going down that way. Oh, right, come on. Yeah, you do keep having these issues with the camera angles. Come on, you. We're going that way. Right, so what have we got here then? I think if we work on this side. Graphite or is that Wolframite? That's graphite. Okay. Yeah, if we work on this side, we should be able to create quite a nice sort of um, level playing field or level area out on this side that we can then continue to build a base on. So, firstly, let's let's do that. Run, forest! Right, but let's put this... No, no! Put this in... This is one of the issues with this game chat, is that the camera angles do not like you at times. There we go. We can sort of smooth all of this out. All of this, we can actually, no, we can dig all this out, so we can actually see the monument. B. 
But yeah, so as you can see at the moment, I'm using a leveling terrain tool. There are different terrain tools you can get where they will level the land, they will curve the land. They can do pretty all sorts. You can dig it, you can build it. You just have to make sure you've got a, uh, a dirt canister and that you have enough dirt to do what you're planning on doing. Right, I think that area is going to be big enough. Let's start working our way through some of this. So to do that, I'm going to move this back into the centre. Because again, I've got the thing on there that has limitless power, but just not... It doesn't produce it very quickly. It produces it quick enough for my gun. All of this I can just dig out and not have to worry about the power going things. My gun's got um, mods on it. And normally when you're using a terrain gun to remove terrain, you don't use any power up. But once you start putting mods on your gun, it does use power up. We can level all that out. Get rid of a load of that. There we go. This thing's looking a hell of a lot better now. Oh, you're a graphite. I'm going to put you over there. Um, I think what we are going to do we are going to get the level again. We're going to level out this way a little bit more. There we go. Nice. So... There's our ship. Let's pull this off here. Don't need the organic. You see, I have realised that I've fucked up already, but it is what it is, I suppose. Um, no, I might not have, actually. I might not have. Might be able to get away with this. Guess we'll soon see. I don't think there's anywhere I can connect that to the ship, is there? Ah, but no, no, I haven't fucked up. I can do it this way. Not the way I wanted to do it, but I can do it this way. Put the small trailer on there. Put the power on there. We're going to get you to make a medium printer. that out of the way. See, now the big question is, that power supply, if I take that off there, it does. Okay, so I can connect that onto there. Take the small printer off, put you down. Connect. You can connect on there. Here you go, chat. Look, Starting to form this new base now. So, what do we need for the table? Three resin. So that's these. Come on. So, again, it's not the quickest, but... There's limitless energy there, it's not going to run out. Let's drop stuff off my backpack. Onto there. Have an 
oxy generator so we're going to put that oxy generator on one of the platforms it's going to give us the ability to power oxygen from wherever we are have a quick wander over here see what we can see so welcome to Calador chat uh, we're looking kind of like a desert planet oh nice so we've got an exo cache down there we need some dynamite we've got some compound over there brilliant hoping there's going to be wolframite up here we need wolframites wolframites iron Oh, in fact, hey look chat, there's Wolframite, nice, we, we literally couldn't have got any closer to the Wolframite. And here we have the slow printer printing. Although when we use the large printer, because we're going to use the same fuel cell, it means that the, the large printer is going to print even freaking slower. Ding! So... There is our table. Put that over there. We need to make a large printer off here, which is three compound. One, two, three. So we're going to make the large printer and then use the large printer to make the um, landing pad. And we can put the landing pad over here or something. And uh, Basically, it just means that every time we want to land the rocket on this planet, um, we can actually land directly at our base instead of landing half a million miles away. So I think what we'll actually do is we'll... Pick up this. My ex wrote me and I should not do it. Oh my fucking god, stop me somebody, stop me please. Same river, repeat. What, your ex is asking to get back together with you or? Hold me back, chat. Hold me back. You had an agreement? Go on. Explain, I'm intrigued. Oh, if you both got to a certain age and you were still single, you got back together. Quite sure what my astronaut here was doing there, just sort of going. Oh, I'm going to throw this uh, this fucking thing all the way up in the air. Come on, back out. Drag you over here. Plug you into you. For you, we want those. See, it'll print it. It's just going to take a, a sweet, uh, its own sweet time. So, we're also going to 
whip out the oxy generator. We're going to whip out the old track ball. Uh, that printer can go on that. Oxy generator for the moment can go on here. There we go, we've got oxygen flowing. Tractor can come out here. I'm going to take that off there and plug that in that. Okay. Yeah, here we go, chat. We, it's um, only like a, a little bit, but we're actually going. So we've got the tractor, got printers. We have an organic on there for some reason, but I've got an organic on my backpack as well. Once this is printed, we will put this sort of over here somewhere, get it out of the way. Let's just dig some. There we go. So I right now come back over here, go to that to level out. Wonderbar, there we go. Uh, fuck, if I do this now, it will end up with an arranged madridge, most probably. I should not. It won't It won't be so dumb. Gosh, I hope I'm not there. Yeah, um... If, if it's not the right thing to do, Elk, I would quite simply not do it. Um, because that is definitely something you have control over. Oh shit, Wolframite isn't fucking iron, is it? It's tungsten. Oh well. Got tungsten now. Yeah, I, I can't can't sort of turn around and say, yeah, yeah, you know, if you if you've made the, if you've made that agreement, then you have to accept it. No, quite frankly you've if it was said and you meant it, you wouldn't be saying it's dumb now, would you? So the fact that you're saying, gosh, I hope I'm not that dumb and you shouldn't do it, I would say you probably shouldn't do it. Why is that not level? Let's... We were leveling off this. Off that section. Don't mind having no power. Yeah, do that. That's, that's fine. Oh, I think I'm stealing the one power off the thing, which is why it's not doing it. There we go. It's nearly finished printing it, chat! Also look on this. No, it wasn't that was small. Or oh no, wait, I made the rocket fuel. I 
make the rocket engine? Did I not make the rocket engine? Shit. Oh, I don't think I brought the stuff for the fucking rocket engine. Oh, bollocks. Well, we're stuck here now. Why won't my camera accept what I'm asking it to do? Thank you. There we go. Yeah, because that rocket engine is scrap. Because it's fucked. Got that over there. Um... Shit. I don't have the stuff to make the rocket engine. Oh, I never got the ammonium, didn't I? Oh, fuck. Okay, right, yep. Yeah. Right, so, uh, slight change of plan, chat. <laughs> um, we're stuck here until I can find some ammonium. Oh, well. Oh, no, 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 no. That one. That. Drop that on. That. That on there. Disconnect that. I'm going to drop that there. Hopefully lock that in place. <laughs> well, shit. Okay. Right, it's not a problem. What do we need to find? We need to find ammonium and alley, I think it was. Um, we're also going to need... Oh no, we've got all the printers we need. Just need ammonium and alley. Oh no, we need a smelter. Shit, we need a smelter. Okay. Let's take that off there. Drop it over that. On there. So for a smelter... I need two compound, one resin. It's organic, right? We have no compound, no resin, so. We've got compound over here. No, no, we don't. That's not a compound. That is, though. Grab a couple of these because we're always going to use it. Um, does my compass show that as home base? It shows us where the rocket is, that's fine. So we need resin. Oh, bollocks. We need resin and ammonia. Oh, is that ammonia? Is that ammonia? We could get really fucking lucky here, chat. Oh dear lord, it is. Oh, oh. Right, I'm gonna drop the organic in there. We don't need that. 
Jump on that. <coughs> well, that was bloody. Oh, there's resin. Nice. Oh, holy shit. There's a load of ammonium there. Okay. Holy shit balls. Uh, we're in the dunes. That resin. I I assume that you're not going for the arranged marriage elk. Sorry what, was that? Sorry, what was that? I was in my thoughts. I said, I assume you're not going for the arranged marriage. Or down that route. Little tractor can almost he's nearly there. Yeah, look at that. Never any doubt the tractor could do that. Ah, there is a ship down there. Huh? Tim Calador is very sparkly. Right. That's recent. What's this one where you got to go into this side? Yes. Ah, here we go. What are you? Sulfur. Okay. What have we got on the tractor? Ah! That works out really well, actually. So. You on there. Copper. Nice. Solar. Packager. You're coming with me. No, oh, put it down. Open it up like that. We can drop stuff on it as well. Need the resin. Nurse. Uh, we are talking about it. Well, at the end of the day, Elk, it, it's your your call, but I, I think uh, it would be a wrong idea. If if you uh, if you talk about it and get into like a genuine relationship that you uh, you want to get into, that's one thing. But if it's you know, ah, well, we're getting into it just because we can. It sounds like a recipe for disaster.
so <clears throat> I'm gonna need a, a table and a smelter. There's three resin. Oh, shit, I'm not gonna have enough fucking resin. Free resin for another platform. I saw a wolf for my. Oh, wait, I could do that. Let's. Infilter, small generator. We do have some organic, so let's. We can speed things. There we go. So I can now toggle that on and off because it's going to start eating the power from the track. But if I if I leave it on, yeah, if I leave it on, what happens is it basically uses or it fills up the tractor with power. Fills up the other machine and then just burns all the excess power off and just wastes it. So I'm kind of toggling it on and off. That way we get the most out of it. Here we go. Turn it on. Grab you. Wait. Grab you. Go further back. There we go, and that cable goes underneath. Smashing! That goes on that. Large platform smelter. Two resin, one compound. I don't have any resin left. What do I do? No, no, that's organic. No, I don't. Okay. up. You on there. So I need resin. Uh, I'm going to drop you on there. Oh, I've got another resin. That's one resin. Um, I've, I've got one resin. It's two resin, one compound in it. Yeah. Need another resin. Okay. She works quite well because there's a resin field over there and a resin field here, so. Resin. Resin. One more resin. Yeah. Oh, fucking hell. How much? Right. We had compounds somewhere nearby, so. Uh, I will have to leave it open. So you, you might be having an arranged marriage, you might not. 
Um, how? Right, well, that's all the resin and compound I can haul. Oh, and I actually have a copper as well, so I could start making the railway station stuff. So could I do that? Could I have the railway track? Oh, yes. I could have the railway track come along here and then just up this bit. Just create the base in there. Or have the railway track just sit behind the uh, base. Just go down towards the core that way. Yeah, either of those work quite well. Um... I mean, this guy would be kind of a safe option, and I don't have to decide right now. Well, at the end of the day, it's up to you. Uh, one resin. Two resins. Alright, we're creating a smelter. Yeah, certainly don't jump into a decision like that, Alk. Have some time to tinky-tink about it. Might be something you decide you want to do, but... Again, don't don't go jumping in head first if it's absolutely not 100% guaranteed that it's the right thing. Oh, Cags is lurking. I've got to stretch. And the hydrate. Hi, Cags. Yeah, I'm not doing that. We will wait. That, that probably makes a bit more sense, to be fair. If you wait and then... Because you never know what's going to come around the corner. Right, I still don't have any alley, so I can't... Oh! Uh, yeah, I don't want that one. We'll do that. Um, and we can start making the Wolframite. That's fine. Uh, which is tungsten. But I can't... Can't make the... Oh god, I can't make the... Um thruster to get back off this planet. Uh, I'll give myself probably the next three years, then we'll see. That makes sense. Again, that makes a lot of sense. How are you feeling at the moment, Cag? Talking tungsten. Refined tungsten from Wolframite. There we go. Sweet. That was done. New mission. Material matters. New mission. Digging deeper. What? does it take to make the train start in here? That's the rail car, the rail engine. It must be the small printer then. Right, if I take the packager off... Take that off there, but no... No! We're back to where you were. Right, we're going to lock you in place to stop that happening. Put that on there. Oh. Lock you as well. Put a small printer on there. For a rail bundle, I need resin and alley. So I can, I've got the resin, that's not a problem. It's the alley that I'm having an issue with. So this is... Is this Wolframite? Yes. I think I've got one copper somewhere. I had a copper that I found in Tungsten, tungsten, tungsten. Where's the... I swear I had a copper. I do have a copper, it's on my back. Being a Okay. 
so I could probably do with another big table. It's going to be what, another three resin. So we can build that. Uh, not too bad. Going to do a few chores, then light workout before dinner. Yeah, make sure it's light though, okay, Cag, because again, you've not long come back off surgery, so... What I need to do is I need to find Ali. Once I find Ali, I can start making train tracks and stuff like that. Um, oh, I can probably need to make a set of tethers, thinking about it. Glow sticks, small print tethers. There we go. Yeah. Uh, what do we need for the medium storage? Oh, right, okay. Medium storage, two resin. Hey, look, we got that. One, two. Right, both of those are building quite nicely. Uh, so what we're going to have to do in a minute is we're going to have to go underground on this world to try and find <coughs> some alley. Aluminium. Cool, that's all printed. Put that on there. That up. Start shifting crap off my backpack. Take those off there because otherwise I'm going to print and I'm going to mean it. Right, so we're going to jump on the tractor. Pull the tractor out of the way. You. Oh no, you're a mile out of place. Better, but you still. Too far this way. There we go. That's as good as. We'll lock it down. Tractor. Throw the tractor. Hopefully we should be able to cut that. That. The problem is, is that we are going to take that one. Right. So. Dig you up so you're out of the way. And I put tethers around here but it doesn't matter where you are around this thing it doesn't matter where you are around this thing you're always going to be tethered to it oh, it's now 
Like that. Smooth this area off. Like it should have been. Right? Smoothie, smoothie. And again, because I've got the power source on my backpack, that makes it fucking amazing. Um, so where's the edge of this? The edge of it's there. If I get the train track, and we'll go... We'll go literally down here. So, let's do that. We're gonna start digging down. So, we need to find some alley. Once we find alley and resin, we're gonna start making train tracks down to the surface. Down to the core. slide all the way down that. Artifacts? Oh, you've got to be shit that I, I can research, I guess? Oh, Oki gone. Oki gone! Yep, needs to remember I haven't put the train tracks down here so I don't get oxygen. Yeah, for everybody who didn't know this as well, whatever side of your backpack you have your tethers on, so if you have it in this shoulder pad on the left, or any of these four on the left, when you put a tether down, it will appear on the left. If you put them at the right-hand side, when you put it down, it puts it on the right. So, just a weird thing, for anybody who didn't know that, you can actually control which way your character puts the tethers down, simply by what side you put them on your backpack. And for anybody, again, for any, something else. Exiled King, how are you? Welcome, welcome. And yeah, another thing for anybody who's never done it, if you put a tether down, so I'll drop one there, it's six steps, and then you put another one down. So you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six. It breaks, put another one down. That is how far you can put a tether. So six steps is the optimum distance to put a tether down. Little weird things you learn when you uh, keep playing this. The thing is, when you're sliding down here like this... Oh, no, that one didn't go. Alright, so... I'm gonna level you out. Oh, we're not going to level you out, because there's literally nothing level here. Oh. Uh, that's about as level as it gets, so I guess we'll level it out there. Oh, yeah, that's massively not level. <laughs> you're, oh, wait, you're a research item, so what are you, are you guys not research items? Artifacts. I don't know what they are. You learn something new every day? Yep. Uh, I know the optimum distance between uh, by the fact that the second blue line disappears uh, is when you place another tether. Yeah. Those artifacts are for the rail line quest. Oh, okay. So I've got a train on my, my base on the, the first world, so I've got a train going all the way down to the core of the planet. Ooh, hello. Um, I'll take a free... Pin generator. Hello, Wolframite. I already have you. Your power 
interesting. I might be able to unlock you. Spiky plants. Fine. Okay. Uh, let's make our way back. Because I haven't got many tethers at the moment. So. So what I'm going to do then, if they are part of a quest, I'm going to leave them there for the moment. I'm just going to carry on going straight down this way. Oh, wow, that didn't take long to break into a uh, into the next la layer, did it? There we go. Let's go and bang a few tethers down here. Uh, a man after my own taste. I always build a train to every core. I used to do ramps and then tractors. Um, but then I did... I, I started this one not too long ago and I put a train all the way down to the core. And I just went, oh my god, this is so much easier because you just literally go, go! And you don't have to worry about any ramps. You don't have to worry about, um, about actually fucking steering. You just literally set the train to go and away you go. Uh, but it means that, obviously, when you use the satellite to travel between different planets, that when you go back to your original planets, you, all you're going to have to do is just go, right, I don't have to run all the way to the surface. I'm just going to call the train. There we go. So... Oh, hello! Well, we, we wanted some Wolframite. Um, how about that? How about a fuckload? Ah, Ali is what we actually need. So. Yep, that'll do. Uh, I think you can research them, but only uh, but only advised after you finish the train quest. That is copper. That's copper. Oh yeah, we had malachite, didn't we? Yeah, it's malachite underground and wolframite on the mountains. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That's copper. It's all right. It's on because we're on Calador. It's on De Solo that it, the wolframite's underground, isn't it? Yeah, 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 yeah. I fucked up. I got the wrong planet. Also, the joys of being partially colorblind. The fact that you look at it and you go, hmm, the copper and the wolf might look kind of the same. Ah, well. Uh, did you do a loop the loop in the core? No, I didn't. I, I literally had it come down and just rest on the side of the core. Um, but I, I imagine at some point I'm going to um, do that. I did say to one of the other guys who comes on and plays, he might might come on a bit later, um, what I was going to do is go to a planet set up with enough rail track and just literally go, right I'm digging a hole straight down and I'm going to put the rail track all the way down and literally go, right, I'm having a train going straight down to the core literally in a line straight to the bottom uh Go there. Drop you in there to keep powered. Oh, we can put you on there as well. How come I can hear the wind whistling past me, and yet that thing's not spinning at all? Oh, you can place rails on walls and ceiling. Yeah, I when I was trying to build my first tunnel with the rails all the way down, it would kept putting the bloody rails on the on the on the walls and on the ceilings, and I'm going, no, I want them on the floor. Let's go, no, no, go away. We're putting them where we want to put them. But, oh, okay. Uh, okay. Right, 
Oh, you're probably going to kick that back onto there, aren't you? Nope. Fine. Rail post. I need resin, which we've got over there. Let's take take some of this stuff off. Tungsten. Uh, yoink. Um, I'm gonna need another resin. When you're done, another alley. Oh shit! Oh no, wait, it's fine. 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 Right, so we're gonna build the rail post. Uh, you need copper for the rail engine. Yeah, I managed to find a random copper. Um, which one are you? Your tungsten. Yeah, there you go. I found a random copper out while I was uh, on on the surface. Uh, take the light off. There. Wait. No, I'm going to put my light back on that side. I'm going to put the rail track on that shoulder. Put you on there. You on. There. I don't want you to make more rail track at the moment. I want you to make a solid fuel thruster. Ammonium. Nice. Although I think you can cheat. If you don't have copper, you can make a rail cart and then put a um, a buggy seat on it. And that allows you to control it as well. So if, if for some reason you couldn't get hold of copper, you can do it all just with, I think it's alley and compound. Hey, the wind's going. What are you doing, Big Fluff? Are you trying to find out where you're going to go lie down? What's the matter? Oh, the little Fluff has taken your bed, has she? Right, my big dog is walking around the living room like a lost sheep. It's because the little dog's kicked him out of his own bed. Put that there. Dum, 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 dum. Uh, oh, there's no... Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So... We are absolutely positively going to want you... Oh, turn around. Absolutely positively going to want you up here. Uh, it was a bit lower than I wanted it to be, but it'll be fine. Might try and get it. I'll put that there for now. Let's see. I put that down the side of the base. Connect. Kind of don't want it to go that far. Still, we want it to go further than that. There we go. Sorry, chat. This is me being a, a perfectionist pain in the ass. Ah, my camera's doing funny things. Right, come here. There we go. If I put that there. Like that. If we get another one. The other one up here.
Okay, that's fine. So all we need to do is connect power to that. So which, if we take you... I don't think you are going to be enough to connect. That's fine. That's fine because we can take. Where is it? Back of it. We can take you. Put you. Down here. Where is it? Turn. No! God! Which one are we picking up today, chat? Because it's not the bloody one I'm trying to pick up. But you under there like that. Right, you I wanted back on the shadow line. There we go. You can go under there. You can go under there. There we go. We've now got power to the train. Uh, if you smelt copper, you can make a medium storage of solar panels. Yeah. Um, at the moment, the thing is, I've got the... Got it on my backpack? No, got it on there. So I'm just using that at the moment. Um, and then I will start building some bigger, bigger and better solar things. Or solar or wind. I don't know which one I'm going to build yet. One resin, one alley, one copper. So, there's the alley. Oh no! I used my last resin up. God damn. No, that's tungsten, you knob. This is, again, this is part of the problem of being partially colorblind is being able to see which one's which. That's copper. Right, so those can go on there. No, 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 no. That go on there. That go on there. <laughs> is he a sheepdog? No, my, my big dog is a German Shepherd Cross Alaskan Malamute. So when you look at him, he looks like a wolf. Um, I believe there is a picture of him on my Discord. I could be wrong. Uh, we're going to put this on the front there. Yeehaw! And then the um, the other dogs I've got, the little ones. I have. Um, a Staffordshire Bull Terrier, so a Staffy, crossed with a Collie, so that is a, a sheepdog. Um, but she's stone deaf. She was born stone deaf because she's got white skin. And what you'll find is most dogs that have white skin when they're born, they don't. Um, the the all of the sort of all of the nerves in the ear are present. Um, but the the actual connections between the nerve endings and the, the ear for the sound, um, they don't develop properly. So she was born deaf. She's absolutely stone deaf. She, whee she's laying in front of me right now. Um, and literally a bomb could go off and she wouldn't hear it. She might feel obviously the pressure change, but she wouldn't hear it. Um, my third dog is a Boston Terrier crossed with a Jack Russell. So he's smaller than her, but he is just like a little ratting machine or a, a little gun dog. Um, you basically send him into the, the grass to scare creatures out and he'll do it. Uh, you generally want to connect it to your main power grid. Ah, I see what you're doing there. Yeah, I was just connecting it that way and then I've got all the power grid connecting across to everything else. Um, right, so let's... Put a rail engine on there. Get a rail engine going. Um, for the moment, I think I'll have just a rail engine and possibly one one cart. Because at this point in time, I'm not going for massively trying to move equipment and move materials. It'll be purely to try and get down to the core um, and plant rail track on the way. Rail track! Has anybody got anything interesting planned this week? Is 
what what are people doing apart from work? I mean, last week I went and saw Oppenheimer, which was really, really good. This week, um, I think there might be a... I think there might be a friendly hockey game on. Um, Pre-season, so I might go and see that. Of course, everybody else got planned, apart from work, because we all have to work and nobody wants to work. Uh, oh. <laughs> I need to unpack it before you can put it on the bloody rail, you knobhead. Uh, no, other way around. There we go. No, 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 no. It's been so long since I've played this. Uh, two resin, one alley. Alley. Resin, resin. That's building. Uh, let's speed it up. We got a little Jenny on there, so that'll speed it up a bit. But yeah, what I'm going to try and do is get the train down to the core again. Make sure the train line looks attractive. It's one of the... I have to have it aesthetically pleasing. I don't know why. I've seen so many people play this game and just go, I'm throwing that there, I'm throwing that over there. That's going there. If you've ever seen... Um, there's a guy who does um, streams and YouTube called Josh. Um, it's Let's Game It Out. And he just breaks and abuses everything um but his bases they're they're all over the place they're freaking terrible um but he's just trying to break the game the last time i played this i made literally a shed load of tables and i had like a full-blown power field so i had there's all of my generators there's all of my um all of my solar there's all of my wind there's all of that but i had it with um that is good, isn't it? Yeah. I had it with, um, like, logic switches on it. So, literally, it was if the power generation of that power field dropped below a certain level because the wind shut off, because the, it was night time, so the solar didn't kick in, what it did is that then sent a logic, um, a logic signal to the generators, and all the generators turned on. So, I had a constant uh, power flow. I then had automatic um, robot arms taking um, organic and carbon. Oh, sorry. One of them was taking organic. The other one was taking... Uh, one, was, one was taking organic to the small... Did I get it right? Was taking organic to the small bloody um, generators. The other one was taking organic, putting it on a smelter... And then I had a second arm taking the carbon off the smelter and putting that on the big generators. So I had it all automated and it was all done off logic switches. Low power. That's fine. Woo -woo. Right, because what I can do now... Let's go. Blink. Come on, camera. Stop playing me up. No, don't want it on the ceiling. What are you trying to connect to down there? What have you successfully... Oh, hello. A marker deployed by exodynamics to indicate the location of value serves as a rail line terminus and aids in transporting items yeah, but I don't want it to connect to you so can I move you I must be able to move you right. deal with that in a minute You know what? Correction. We'll deal with that now. So. Oh, that's... Oh, I'm going underneath my ramp. There we go. Right, so let's quickly rebuild the old ramp. Wunderbar. 
Right, I want to move you. We Move you out the way at the moment. Come with me, and we'll see a world of pure imagination. Go over there. You are not my biggest concern. My biggest concern is making sure I can get this to the core. Oh, camera, stop playing me up. There we go. No! No! <laughs> There we go. Um. Bye. I've loved Let's Game It Out. His satisfactory videos are are fantastic. Oh, where he makes the um. He he makes the bloody I want to say the hurricane, but it's not the hurricane. He makes the giant cone. Um. And then he, he he almost like creates the diamond. It looks like the the symbol out of No Man's Sky. And then once he's finished abusing that, um, he starts bloody um, making like massive bounce pads. I actually, if you ever watch Dodge, um, I show Dodge the the giant man cannon thing um, that you can create that just launches you to oblivion. And we got Dodge to build that. Oh, oh. There we go. Yeah, we got Dodge to build that, but he built the roller coaster of death. Now, if you've never seen the roller coaster of death, it's basically a roller coaster with seven loops, and each loop gets gradually tighter than the last one. And the whole thing is, is that basically, because of the G force, you get. Put, on, uh, put under while riding it by the time you go through the last loop um, the you'll suffer from blood loss to your brain and you die that is why surprisingly it's called the roller coaster of death but dodge made it in um, satisfactory i suggested it and dodge went i really like that idea and just made it and it's like oh okay Right, now this was one of the things that I used to do. Is I, I used to basically try and dig... Oh, bollocks. Fuck ass bollocks. Right. Call the train. Yeah, I used to dig like in a straight line, and then once I got so far, I went, right, okay, now I'm going to do a 180 and dig the other way. I found that it's best not to do that. It's best to dig, dig so far, turn 90 degrees, then carry on digging, then turn 90 and carry on digging again. Whoop, whoop. Uh, good night, everyone. Night, Elk. Have a good one. Sleep tight. Don't do anything I wouldn't do, which means you can pretty much do whatever you want, but, you know, don't tell anybody. Right, let's grab those to start off with. Come with me, and you'll see. We're gonna... Put one just down there. There we go. Doesn't matter where you are around there, now you will get, uh, get a tether. You are coming with me. Cool. Whee! Yeah, as you can see, it's not exactly the most straightest, but... Uh, you are capable of many things. Good you don't say. Uh, good you don't say, be like me. Then I'd have to find some trouble to cause. I don't cause trouble. I am as innocent as the day is long. And there are people now going, Wolfie, you're talking out of your ass. Uh, uh, right, we're going to do that. All right, chill out. Uh, we're gonna go to the gap. Oh, right, that's fine. Yeah, we're gonna go down that way. We. Yeah, with the train tracks, we can also go a hell of a lot steeper as well. Uh, no, that's the wrong one. Mm. 
No, come on, there we go. I appreciate that we've put that rather close. We haven't um we haven't really taken advantage of the full length of the train track. Oh shit. I change that anyway, because I know I don't have to, but just in case for some reason somebody ends up running down here. Nice. Where's the poison plant? He's over there. Not anymore! No, come. I need my camera to look down a little bit. There we go. Not too much. Nice. Wee. Wink. Uh, we're gonna pull you off the ceiling. Uh, if you face down and place them behind you, it's much easier to place them. Oh, right, okay. So, oh, let's have a look where we are on this one. Let's level this out. Refresh my ox imagen while in those tight spaces. Right, okay. So hang on, so for the moment. Oh, no, that's the wrong bloody one. Oh, no, I pressed the wrong buttons. We do that. Oh! <laughs> yeah, I, I, I think I'm going to have to try that in the tight spaces. Obviously, it doesn't look like it works in these spaces because it sits there and goes, What are you doing? There we go. There we go. Again, I, I, I've, it's been a while since I've played this. Um, and I I think the last time I played it, they didn't have trains in the game. Um, so, it, yeah. They've added trains and I've sort of gone, yeah, I must play this again. And then never really got round to it. Now I've finally got round to doing it with trains. We're suddenly going, oh, shit, there's actually... Uh, Trains are like, amazing. Nice. Pull you out of the wall. So, if I... The first one I want... Yeah, that's actually a lot quicker. That one goes there. Oh, don't know why that one just decided it's going to put it in front of me. Turn blue, so that's fine. Put you there like that. Nice. Uh, we'll go for this level. Nom 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 nom. Uh, that height should be fine to go down to the next area. Dig you out the floor.
So I know if Dra comes and plays this later, what Dra wants to earn is he wants to earn the hoverboard again. I think that's the last time we played this was they just introduced the hoverboard. I think I think it was the update after the hoverboard they introduced trains. Okay, so we got loads of stuff. Oh no, my oxygen is getting low. Whatever shall I do? Come with me and you'll see a world that I'm trying to build and making it look difficult. No, still the wrong side, Wolfie. So again, I know it's not perfect, but it just gives us that nice sort of uh, edging. Try it again. Right, okay, so that's fine. You are, are going to connect to both, aren't you? Yep. You bastard. Right, okay. Oh, fuck, I don't have any land. What are we doing? I can take it from the ceiling here. Mmm. -hmm. I'm being a knob. Right. So I'm going to build this through there and try and go down there and disconnect where that's connected to. It's got to be another one of those um, points. Whee! Oh yeah. Nice. Ooh, fuck. Fuck a duck a duck. No. I will deal with you later. At the moment, trying to get down to the core. Oh, gravity's starting to go low, so we're getting closer. Uh, if you do the gastropod quest line, it is very rewarding. Yeah, we've done the first one on... Oh, God. It's not DeSolo. It's not Kalador. What's the first planet called? Uh, planets. Silver, yeah. We've, we've done that one on Silver... Um, we have this, yeah, we have to solo and Kalador to do next. So I think the one on silver gives you the RTG, doesn't it? Which is um, just amazing for power. Especially having that at a, at a low level. That'll do perfectly. Then what we'll do is... We will work off this one. Come with me, and you'll see that I'm tearing the fuck up out of this planet. Wee. Nice. Kalador is the most used snail. Ah, okay. I don't think we've ever rescued the one on this planet before, so... It will be very big. Well, it won't be a very big learning curve because they, they don't seem that difficult to rescue. But it will be a learning curve to see what it offers. See, again, this is the thing. Astronaut, I, I loved it, but I've not played it for so long. Down we go. Oh, yeah, there's just, like, train station central down there. Oh, sorry, Kalador is your most used snail. That's right, I thought, I thought, I read that as Kalador is the most used snail. It's like, ah, okay. Oh, 
not slightly too far back. Oh, nice. Uh, come with me, and we'll see. What the hell are we gonna find down here? Oh no 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 no! Okay, well at least I can fill my oxygen up, and then I can take some of this wall out. Do a refill. I'm gonna drop down. I'm gonna run round. There we go. We're gonna run round. No sweat. Look at that. Planned it. <laughs> Let's go with that, chat. Let's go with that. Ah, there we go. Really. See, I, I like to set up these staging areas, so you've got like a little flat piece of land that you can always work on. What are you? I'm going to pull you out of the way for the moment. An obelisk. Okay. Oh, yeah. Shit, they do that, though. Whoop, whoop. Yeah, so we've got train things, obelisks, research. Gravity's starting to get funky, so. Funky! So we're going to go. That's coming down this way, so we're going to go that way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull that out of there. Try and dig that out the floor. Or dig it all the way into the floor. Oh, oxygen! Oxy bubble! Uh, it probably is, honestly, the Sana would be the second, or would be a close second. Yeah, because I think the only one we've ever rescued was Silver. Um, and that one, correct me if I'm wrong, that one, all it does is it, it glows. But obviously if you feed it the first time, it gives you the RTG, which is just incredibly useful. Whee! Get all that back in, ain't gonna make much difference because in a minute we're gonna start digging again. Level it out so nobody would know. Okay, we're gonna take some of that off, but the moment we put the train track down, it if it was in the way, it would uh, remove it for us. Nice, there we go. So, probably need to put another track down. Uh, nice. Going down here. Come on. Yeah. Always a sweet spot for making these ramps. Just gotta find it. Oh, of course, yeah, of course, again, I'm being a knob, aren't I? Because it'll let me know when I'm near the core of the planet. It'll tell me. It'll say, location. Core. Which, to be fair, I don't think can be too far away from this. Yeah, it's definitely not too far away from this, because I'm digging down. But, if you look, I'm now managing to sprint back up. Ah, but you see, I'm getting slower as I get away from the core. 
which means the gravity is pulling me down more. As I get to the core, you can run quicker. Suffocating. I need some dirt. See, so is there anything I can actually put on these, or it's just something you can have at the end of a track? Just something to look nice. Oh no, it's a mission object. Okay, so there is there is actually a mission with those. Oh, oh, I've used all. Oh shit. I think I left my other train track at the surface. Uh, no, jump off. Put that on there. Whee! That is so nice, just being able to put the controller down and go, Oh, right, I'll have a drink while we uh, just blitz back up to the surface by ourselves. Oh no, look at it. I might have used all my train track up. I might have to make some more. Nice. Um, yeah, I think I used it all up. Okay, so it's just resin and alley, isn't it? So. Rail tractor. Rail post. Oh, I don't think I've got any alley left. That's fine. I can collect more alley all I'm down there, so... Choo-choo, motherfuckers! So what we'll do is we'll stop just on this sort of first floor. Um, because there was... Oh, was this floor anyway? Yeah, it was alley over there, wasn't it? So we'll just go grab that. Over here? Yeah, because yeah, 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 because I said that was wolframite when it's not. That's copper. But there is a shed load of alley here, and I didn't bring the RTG. So the moment the light goes out, it goes out. And I lose if half the effects of my gun. Alright, it's fine. You're carbon and you are absolutely useless because the rest of it's fucked. Celebrate. Yeah, I do apologize. We do just get random singing in the chat. Come on. Depending on what I'm doing tomorrow, Dodge will be streaming tomorrow, uh, and he might be streaming Grounded, so we might be, who? Oh, might be trying to see if we can finish off Dodge's Grounded game tomorrow. Um, it depends whether we play Grounded or whether we play something else. But I've completed Grounded, um, and it's, it's a really good storyline, but we are, I think we're on the last sort of story mission with Dodge. Beat all the bosses bar one. Um, so once we complete the story, we've then got to introduce him to wasps. 
Oh, I've got a text message. Just give me one moment, chat, while the train goes down. I would say it's difficult being popular, but I'm not popular. I was never one of the popular people, and I don't mind it. We are going down here. Oh, right, hang on. Drower has invited us to a party. Just so chat knows. Hello. Hiya, Drower. How you doing? Um, yeah. Oh, not too bad. I love the fact that my all It's just let me know that my audio has been included. In my own game, uh, in my own stream. Oh yeah, you've got to include your own audio. Got to go uh, tick that button. Tick that button. Um, no, just keep pressing the wrong one. <laughs> Are you still on the first planet? Uh, no, I'm on the next one. But I, if you if you want to play and you spawn in, um, I have a spare thruster so I can get back. Yeah, I'm just logging now. Well, I'll see where it spawns me first. Um, I think this... I think the way that this ramp is going, chat, it's going to level out before we hit the floor. So I think... We're uh, yeah, it put, it's put me on the first planet. Okay. Uh, give me a minute. I will call as a train. Do you need me to bring anything with? Um, just anything you want, really. So I've got, do you want, I've got small, do medium, want... large printer. I've got a couple of tables. I've got a a landing pad. We're currently working on the train system. I have the, the we have two RTGs, and I've got them both here. Uh, I was going to bring the QRTG with me. The QRTG? The small one. Yeah, they're both here. There's one here as well. I've got one on my backpack now. I just put it, took it off one of the things and put it on my backpack. Oh, right. Oh, maybe I left one at each. Yeah, sorry, I think I did. I think I took... Yeah, I, I left one there, brought one with. Uh, I don't know what to do next. I've beaten the game twice, so I'm not in the mood to do it again. So I'm trying to think of goals to keep me playing. Um, have you see? I I wondered whether you could do this because I know you could do it on other things, which are ridiculous. Could you literally build like a giant ramp between two planets and have a train track going between them? Because well, I, you know what Wolfie's gonna test. Well, because I know that from Silver you can build a ramp. And you can go, oh. you can go all the way back up to the starting ship, space station. Yes. Uh, I think, I think there's a 
Uh, it's actually a height limit. Uh, right. Launch to another planet. Um, you will need to make a um, but, but a, a thruster. So you're on silver, aren't you? Yep. Oh, cock, I should have probably brought the, um, um, Wolfram out with me. Oh, well. Ah, I'm guessing it's that one just there. Uh, you can't, because after a certain point, you just teleport to another planet. Oh, okay, so you, once you get close enough, you just teleport. Right, so that engine at the moment is fine. To make another engine, I think... Oh, I'm yeah. already grabbing this stuff to make another engine. Um, I've got the latter right. We just need... Sorry, I've got the alley. We just need the ammonium. Yeah, I'm just collecting a ton of it. Cool. I'll take one of those. Oh. Come with me. Yeah, and we'll... Uh, right. Well, I'm going to leave you with that for a minute. I'm going to grab a set of tethers. Maybe a couple of sets of tethers. There you go. Got it. Go down to the core to get some more um, astronium. We've got 21,000 bytes. Yeah, but I'm fairly confident that when we start learning things, that'll go... We'll burn through that. I mean, there's some of the stuff that we can learn, which I've seen, which is... I think we could use, which is like 3,500 bytes each. Well, that's, that's less than seven things if they all cost that much. I'll be honest, I was just looking at uh, the um, hydrogen shoulder thruster. What do we need to make it? Is that iron? Titanium alloy. Ah. I got titanium. We need to make uh, the, um, the atmospheric the chemistry thing, station. don't we? Oh, the chemistry station, yeah. Oh, yeah. But we'll probably need, but we'll probably need the... Uh, Atmospheric condenser. Yeah. Whee! I've made a spare solid fuel thruster. Cool. Drop that one. Uh, uh, oh yeah. I... No, I haven't got anything in my... Uh... My gun. Okay. okay, okay. I'll be back in a second. I'm just gonna go grab my tea. Okay, dokey. Um. Oh, it's right. Okay, okay, okay. Probably needs to do that. Can make a way up the wall there. Nice. Uh, uh, right. What's the matter with you, puppers?
No, 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 no. There we go. Put that up. Actually, think we may have got to the end of the Australian in this area, or just in this this one section. Right over there, that's plants. That stronium over there, that's a stronium. Okay, yep, I take it back. It's all lies. Let's. see if we can actually create something on the level properly. And I'm back. Welcome back. Put some tethers down. Were you sent here by the devil? No, good sir, I'm on the level. Oh, there's a poison plant. Over there somewhere. Behind that. What are you on? Uh, crack cocaine. There's amber now. Uh, no, I'd get arrested else. Okay, so I should be able to just literally start dropping this down there. Whoa! Slightly closer view of my uh, my backpack than I was hoping for. There we go. What are you dropping down where? Dropping astronium down onto the floor because my backpack is full. Yeah, fair enough. Woo -hoo -hoo. Found another big field. Jesus. So what planet or planets have you been to? Uh just Calador. I didn't think Calador had titanium. Uh yes, it does. Jesus Christ! <laughs> Are the dogs peeling the wallpaper again? Uh, no. Um, I may have found a little bit of astronium. Is it bigger than the last deposit you found? Yep. How much bigger? One, two, three, four. These are all the ones I'm dropping. Uh, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, well, that's 21 I've just dropped, not including the other stuff before it. Fair enough, I'm just waiting for the train. Oh, you bastard. Who? You've taken the train, which means you've taken the storage. That's alright, I'll continue to dig it I'll out. I'll be coming back down in a second. I'll continue to dig it out and drop it on the floor.
Looking at that, we may need on... to may need to build another table. Oh, in fact, I've got another table. We may need to build another research station. On my way down. Jesus Christ. How big is this astronium field? Train's back. Uh, you may want to bring a storage over. How's that? You can't see, but uh, if you look up, you might see it raining astronium. Oh, I don't need to look up. It's just raining astronium in front of me. I think the best thing is I didn't bring a medium storage. Fucking hell. Problem? We just saw the pit. There's still more astronium up here that I've not dug out the wall yet. I think you need to set up an auto grabber. What, just to uh, keep filling the research station? Yeah, we can do that. I'm guessing your side's full. Yep. How many more's in there? Uh, that is all that's in the pit. That's good, because that, this is full, and I'm having to pick up this last one. Well, there's still more up in the uh, thing if you want me to go get it. It's up to you. I really don't think we're going to need it somehow. I think we've got that much sodding astronium now.
What do you reckon, chat? Do you reckon we've got enough Astronium? I don't even know if there's anyone in your chat at the moment. Uh, there are. There's a few people in my chat. I think I've still got uh, Exile in my chat. I think I've still got Stu in my chat. I think Kags is uh, hiding somewhere. Yep, Stu's in the chat. Hi, Stu! Hi, Stu. Do you reckon we've got enough Astronium? Wolfie, are you getting more Astronium? Might be. You could, you could always do with more. Do you play Astro near Stu? Oh shit, yeah. Need to bang a tether down, don't I? Bang a little. Do you play Astro Nest, you? Uh, Gerard, do you want to work your way up here and just collect these last ones? Where's up here? Oh, okay. Follow the tethers. Follow the tethers and do some parkour. Uh, Stu said, yes, I've got all of the achievements. <laughs> I don't think we've got all of the achievements. I know we've got quite a few of them, but... I don't know. I'm going to walk myself missing. How many more can you pick up? Uh, three. Do you play any uh, types of game in particular, Stu, or do you just go for whatever takes your fancy? Oh, if there's another um, crystal through there. Right, well, there's another two up here. I should hopefully be able to. There you go, there should be a last one there somewhere. Just rolling down the hill now. Uh, I like co op games. Satisfactory, Astro Near. Um, is, it, is it like. Um, just any sort of building game, or is it like you play co-op shooters, or... Ah, Warframe. I played a little bit of Warframe, but I never yeah. really got on with it. Oh, I actually think... Uh, give me a moment. Give me a moment. Oh, dear. Uh, one... Two. Three. I can collect three more Astronium. Go on, then. Don't leave without me. I think I can collect three more, and I think... It's literally everything. <laughs> Don't leave without me. So the first thing I do is hit the uh, buttons, just for shits and giggles. <laughs>
go back up to the uh, that rooftop area. Yeah, I've heard I've heard that with Warframe. I've heard the same things about Ark. I think the main co-op games we play really will um the grounded in destiny, isn't it, Wolfie? Uh we play Sea of Thieves as well. Um what's it we tried Redfall. Fortunately. Uh again the thing with Redfall was that it uh was... Stu's asking would he be able to join with Astro near or some other or another time. Um I probably say another time, Stu, for the only simple reason being I'm probably only gonna carry on for about another 30 minutes or about half an hour yeah um because unfortunately i've got to get up for work in the morning as much as i don't want to there was part of me that was uh, tempted to be rather naughty this morning and just go <laughs> sorry can't come in i think you should do it tomorrow sorry i meant to... yeah it shouldn't be an issue Stu. I think it'd be quite interesting because I think the last time we had more than two people on Astroneer was when Dodge was there and we just had so many glitches. But then they've done a. It's been fully released since then, so. Hopefully it would have solved most of the issues. Well, yeah, the, yeah, we don't have self driving cars. That was funny though. <laughs> that was hilarious. <laughs> uh, Kag says, give your wife a high five for me and tell her good job. Uh, one moment. Oh, and I've got a stretch on hydrate. Do you still play Destiny Stew? And if you've played Destiny, I have a very important question of what class did you play? Uh, Kags, the wife says, cool, thanks. I think they've secretly been dealing with You've also got a stretch and hydrate. Uh, yes, that's true. Uh, easy with that one. Stretch and hydrate. Pardon me. Yeah, we played Sea of Thieves quite a few times. We played it with Cags, and Cags was sort of sat there going, "Yeah, but I'm never going to be that good at Sea of Thieves. I'm never." And then, like, we we played it a few times, then left her to it, and she played it by herself, and uh, with one of the other friend, other uh, other friends, Bear, and Cags is now really good at Sea of Thieves. I haven't played Sea of Thieves with you two for ages. <laughs> you know, I think I'm going to be one Astronium short because I cannot find it. What class did you play on Destiny, Stu? Oh, and Wolfie, I'll be back in a second there. No, I really don't think I'm going to find it. The new Monkey Island DLC. Yeah, I, I saw that and I'm going, oh my god, like Guybrush Threepwood? And people are going, what are you on about, Wolfie? Guybrush Threepwood. It's Monkey Island! It's got Guybrush Threepwood in it. It's like, uh, okay, Wolfie, if you say it, it's got Guybrush Threepwood in it. And then I started watching the advert and went, oh my god, is that LeChuck? It's like, yes, it's LeChuck. I'm going, LeChuck!
Because I always liked, I think it was in like Monkey Island 2, where you had to do the um, insult fencing. Where you had to insult each other, and it was like the best insult. You knocked the other person back, and you kept doing it. I always thought that was fantastic. That's one of the weirdest things to come back to. What, insult fencing? Oh, she played the Warlock. Warlock for the win! Uh, I don't yeah, know the class name, but I had a Flaming played... Sword. Yeah, Flaming Sword was the Warlock. It was so... Uh... Yeah, I, d I definitely don't know how well I know that class. I definitely haven't played the game far too much, and that's my preferred class. It's not, sun it's not Sunbreaker, that's Titan, isn't it? Dawnbreaker. That's Dawnblade. It. Dawnblade. Again, I haven't played that class far too much. Do you know, I'm running around round here trying to find like another Astronium field, and I cannot find one. I think we may have found one Astronium field that had all of the Astronium for this planet in it. Right, okay, I think I'm going to run back. Oh, crap, I'm going to die. Fine, fine. Over here, let's see. Suffocating. Oh, we're good. Let's get the hell out of here. Where are you going, Dra? I didn't realize you jumped on the train. Yes, that's, that's why I started the train moving. I thought the insult fencing was good too, yeah. Because I remember playing, again, I think it was Monkey Island 2, you couldn't win against LeChuck with the standard insults you had. Oh, sorry, you couldn't, it wasn't LeChuck, it was one of the other women. You couldn't win against her with the standard insults you had. You had to go and learn a special insult to beat her. Uh, Stop playing before they did the splitting of the classes. Especially the classes? I'm going to guess it's um, when you had um, Dawnblade go into Dawnblade and Wild of Radiance and that. Oh, right, yeah, where you had mul uh, multiple supers depending on the um, the subclass you ran. Mm-hmm. As long as you took that branch of the tree. Playing a warlock now, it doesn't matter what you play, you go and do a raid and it's like, yep, so you're going to be well. I don't want to be well. You're a warlock, tough, you're running well. I don't want to run well. <laughs> I have it on my TikTok. It's a, um, a little picture of two warlocks. It's one... That's um what that's throwing a nova bomb. And Bo the other born to nova, forced to well. But yeah, the one's throwing a nova bomb, and the other one is just sat in a well, and it's born uh, born to nova, uh, forced to well. It's like, but it's so true. Right, I'm gonna move that one. Wait, wait, wait. Gonna move this. Plan. That's not far enough. Mods, dynamite, fireworks, probe scanners. Can't do an auto arm yet. Oh, we can. Uh -huh. Yeah, we graphite. Have we got a graphite up here? I don't think we got a graphite up here. Nope. 
Graphite's normally in the mountains. I actually think there's graphite down in, uh, down by the core as well. Uh, you could just... Do you need one graphite? Uh, yes. There you go. One graphite, one alley. Graphite's on the uh, water well, uh, on the uh, source centrifuge. Oh, it's being made. It's been made, or is it being made? Being made. Have you made the auto one? Nope, we don't have an alley. Unless it's on the list I've just been a turn and haven't seen it. There you go, it's melting. Uh, I booted up Destiny recently, I had a full inventory and full bank. I didn't know what to get rid of, so I just logged straight back out. <laughs> yeah, I can kind of understand that. Right, so I'm going to move this. Well, if you ever decide you want to play Destiny again, it's you. We can help you out. Does the auto arm have to go on a table? Yes. Right, we may need a small table. In fact, there is a table here that can put behind. The auto one does need power. I know it needs power, but I'm <laughs> I don't know which way it works. So I can plug that into there, that's not a problem. So if I does it pick it up? Oh no. Does it pick it up from green? Yes. Yes. Right, okay, so I'm going to move this. Uh, in fact, I can just do that. Can't I? That. That entire thing. Closer. all in. It's come back oh, fuck. You stand in the area and it start putting it on your backpack. <laughs> right, so that's all fine. <laughs> oh my god, I did that. Yep, there we go. That should take all of those off that. Start filling up this side. Yeah. Uh, have you got a canister full of dirt? Yes. Put it on the star centrifuge if you would.
What, are you doing another, another auto arm? No, I'm making some more uh, clay. What's that for? Uh, what resource have you got at the other base? Or your new uh, plate on the next planet? Tungsten? Okay. What what do you have at your this base? Do you have a smelter? Yes. I'm ready to head to the other area. Uh, I will be in a minute. We might need another auto arm. We need another graphite to do that. Oh, no! Shit. Okay. What? Well, what Wolfie? The auto arm's going nuts. Because I fucked one. Why thing is the auto arm going nuts? Because I fucked one thing up. Probably could have just pressed stop on it, and it probably stopped it. Turn off. What did you, What did you fuck up? Uh. I went to put the one set of um, astro astronium down, and I put it uh, as I went to put it down. It picked up, or it swapped it for the um, the fucking thing. The fucking thing. Technical term. Uh, the research station. I need to put another shiny on here. On the auto arm? Yeah. Did you ever got another backpack? Is there any more astronium on the train? Yes, there's one. Hey look, I can go on the next uh, auto arm. Yeah, I can't see us running out of bites. No, we'll just run out of power. Right, I'm just going to put my phone on to charge. I'm not just, you know, stood here abandoning everybody. Green is pickup, right? Oh, no, wait, hang on. No, sorry, no, it's the other way. Uh, no. <laughs> yep. Uh, let's put that on there. And turn that off. No, wait, oh, it was the right way. Okay. Does that mean the other one's set up wrong, then? No. Yes. Yes.
Should we head to the next planet then? Hang on. Oh no! Well. Alright, I need to unlock that. Not that way. There we go. That. Uh. There we go. That's sorted it. Right, I had to move the um, the soil centrifuge across because it was putting astronium on that. Schematics for those, uh, and this gives us a platform and a schematic for a platform. Oh, did you mean to check it in the hole? No, but that works. Um, right, so what do we want to take to the next planet then? It's already taking a load of stuff over, but. I'm taking clay. Ah. I'll take those. We've already got a beacon. Yep, already got a beacon. So that's all copper, some resin, all right, I think I'm ready to go. Uh, I got four spots, what do you want? Uh, resin or compound I guess. We have neither. Why don't we have one command? Uh, isn't there not resin over here? No, there's, 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 there's the stuff we make rocket fuel with. Um, whatever you want, then really it doesn't make any difference. I think there's some resin not far this way. I wouldn't bother to say we're only I'm only gonna be on for about another ten, fifteen minutes, so if you want to I'll get to bring it. some I'll bring some alien malachite then. Unless you want to bring some ceramic. That's why I brought the clay. I was gonna say there's a piece of ceramic on here. Uh I'll grab that and I'll grab these other two bits of clay. Enter! Is that fuel for us to still find? Uh, yeah. It is. This is the last thing it's going to have. Yeah, I've got two, uh, two more on my backpack anyway, so... Ah, okay. So, it was... It wasn't a solo. Yeah. You said Calador. Yeah. Where is it? Is that over there? Calador! Right, so look. Oh, I'm guessing it's that one. What gave it away? Uh, the fact that I built a landing pad there. Oh, oh! It's not! This is a different landing pad. There's a, <laughs> there's a gravity globe here. 
Right, okay. Uh... What the hell? Take off and try and find the base. I'll bring, try and bring the graphics globe over. Okay. Uh, so I want to launch to orbit. Well, uh, why is it moving? Graphics globe. You've probably got to pick it up and then move it. There we go. It's not that one. It's got to be that one. Hey, there we go. This is the right one. Put a beacon down, so hopefully you should be able to see the beacon if you get closer. Uh, I'm using the compass to see where you are. Are you moving here? Yeah, I'm just seeing if there's a way around this mountain to go over it. Or trying to go over it in this fucking thing. Because you know how much of a bastard that is. Mm-hmm. Chugga, 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 chugga. Woo, woo! Region Caves. Region, mantle. Now you can call the train. Because you called it before, but I turned it back round. Because, you know, I was in it. So you haven't finished going all the way down? No. Well, so you already know one thing we've got to do. I think this is going to level out before I actually get where I need to go. I already, need, I already know something I need to do. Oh, no. Shit, don't take it. 
What on earth are you doing? My train is not on the move. And what one thing have we got to do? Well, you've never actually completed it yet. Round it down. You find them on the planets. Zebra ball? What? No, there's different. There's oh, I think you, eight you... different pieces. So, are those the little bug things? Don't no, the chest set. Oh, yeah, we never found a complete chest set yet, have we? That. Oh, bollocks. Oh. Go that. You can call the training back. You have an atmospheric condenser here. No, I don't. Don't you? Nope. And how have, how have you got gas? Found it. Okay. Found it? How do you get up there? I fell? Ooh, fuck, 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 I don't want to do that. Fuck, 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 a duck, screw a kangaroo. Uh, it was more gonna be fuck, 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 I'm falling down. I think this is gonna level out. In fact, it fucking has. Oh, god damn it. The floor's there. I'll be back in a second. Oh, am I straight out of dirt? Oh, bollocks. God damn. Son of a bitch.
There we go. I think it's going to end up doing it again. I think it's going to level out before we actually get where we want to go. I'm back. Welcome back. So what are you currently doing? Oh, I'm currently trying to get down towards the core. Oh, hello. I can see something over there. Nice.
Where do you build the uh, train stuff? Um, what, the cars? Oh, that? okay. Yeah. The cars are in the medium print. Hopefully that should do that. Yeah. Oh, sorry chat. Got another text message. Oh, right. Yeah, I'm probably going to sort out the train for this call and then I'm probably going to call it. So if you need the train, you might want to call it back So I've just called it. No, that's fine. So I'm sorting out the, uh, the track for it. Are you on the train or? No, that's why I said you can call it back if you need it. Ah, right, okay. It's on its way! Probably doesn't have an awful lot of power, does it? So I could put that down. That should allow it to come a little bit quicker. I don't know if you can turn on the small generator or something at the surface if you're up there. I am at the surface, but I'm not at the base moment. I'm just running back. How far away is the train from you? Uh, it's about halfway. Low power, reduced speed. Low power, reduced speed. Three quarters of the way. Uh, 
Gotta be coming along the core in a minute. You got there to it the is. Core, then. Yeah. Right, so let's put that on there. Jump on and reverse out. Wee. Right, well, while the train is getting us up to the surface, uh, guys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, um, if you like what you've seen tonight of us playing uh, Astroneer and being silly and having a chat and gone as well, please drop us a follow. It is greatly appreciated. You can follow us here on Twitch, on TikTok, on Facebook, and on YouTube. Um, if you um, want to join us on discord you can also join us on discord go to the twitch about page and the link on there does work um it was fixed but uh yeah we are going to get to the surface then we're going to call it we will be back on wednesday um not sure what we're going to stream but we will find something we might be back tomorrow but it, if we're if we're on tomorrow it will be on dodgy stream probably on grounded so that might be um, trying to fight our way through the, the big finale on Grounded. So yeah, if you've never seen that, please come and join us. If that doesn't happen tomorrow, it should happen on... Oh, it could be Friday or Sunday, because those are dodgy streaming days. But my normal streaming days are Monday, Wednesday, Fridays. We sometimes stream on Saturdays, we sometimes stream on Sundays, or whenever we have a, a co-op game. Oh. But yep, yeah, thank you all for joining us. Try going back now. Thank you all for joining us, guys. We will see you again soon. Thanks, Natalie. So goodbye, everybody. Bye. Hello. <laughs> Hello.